versus Gul'dan. Okay, so next up. Your soul shall be mine. Uh, Crackle. Unbound Elemental, Stormforged X. I would say that hand is, for the most part, pretty good, but I don't want Crackle. I will keep the Stoneforged Axe and the Unbound Elemental, though. Whether it's Zoo or Handlock, those are pretty decent. Wow, that's a lot of golden cards. It makes me look like I'm a Legend player or something, but no, I'm not. Rank 11. It's pretty reasonable, but um, not exactly Legend. So if I do play the Stoneforged Axe, I can coin out an Unbound Elemental. But I think I'd rather just coin it out right now, that Unbound Elemental. Then I can play the Stormforged Axe and buff it up. Unless he wants to spend two removal spells on that Unbound Elemental. I will get the value out of it. I can throw down an Earth Shock as well. I will save that for the Twilight Drake, because he's obviously a freaking handlock. Or something of that nature, which probably me does mean he is playing with the... Uh... Well, is there a... Se no, I'd rather have the Axe be a surprise. You wouldn't expect it. It's not really worth it just for the buff right now. Doomhammer, also an overload item. We'll work with that uh, Unbound Elemental if it gets to stick alive. Hopefully he plays a Drake. Damn, that's not what I wanted. I need either BGH or Hex. Come on, I have four of those in my deck. Ugh, that is so disgusting. Okay, Taunt Totem. Okay, what's that put me at? To the face. And I'm in trouble. How the hell did I not draw a Hex or a BGH when I have two BGHs and two Hexes in the deck? That variance, though. Ugh. Well, if he Shadow Flames it, I'm okay with that. If he hits me in the face for 8, I'm okay with that. If he trades for the 3-5, I guess I'm okay with that. I am not okay with that. <laughs> Ow. Goodness. BGH, thank you. I've got the beast in my side. Okay, do I trade for that one? Yeah, I think I do. Okay. His board's cleared. Both of his mountain giants are gone. I will not hit his face. Just in case of molten. No real reason to play it that quick. He'll probably hellfire anyway. Next turn, Azure Drake, obviously. Um, unless he plays a uh, four. Uh, shit, that's not what I wanted to see. He's gonna Shadow Flame that? Hmm, okay, one Shadow Flame down. Not bad. I'm actually perfectly happy with that. Okay, so Azure Drake. Ah, uh, do I hit him? Yeah, okay, I'll hit him this turn. I kind of wish he didn't get a free giant there. Okay, Siphon Soul, fine. So just play another Azure Drake. He's kind of representing me, just not trying to get down to the hunter, or to the giants. Which is good, because um, I want to kill him. And in fact, I will hit him. This turn, he plays giants for the taunts. I will BGH it. If he play Actually, I have a counter to anything he could play. Unless he plays something and then Shadow Flames. But he already played one Shadow Flame, so I think I'm actually in a good position to threaten Lethal right here. Okay, Hellfire, and then what? Portal Coil? Dark Bomb? Okay. I think I will Mana Type. Okay, first, hit the Totem button. Secondly, thirdly. I have all the answers I need. I just need him to uh, basically not heal up to 19 with an antique heal bot. He doesn't know what I've got in my hand, but this deck is meant to counter handlock. Double BGH, bro. <laughs> Good luck with that, Mr. Giants. At the same time, this deck is completely immune to BGH because it has nothing with 7 and more attack and no way to really buff those minions up. I think it has one Rock Rider, though. Okay. Fine, silence it. What do I care? Molten Giant, okay. And then the Taunt. My shield for cool. 
Unfortunately for you, suck at BGH, GG. And now you die! Oh, well, let me see about that, actually. Ha 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 ha! Handlocks it! <laughs> Fuck you, handlock! <laughs>